Oh, Jason. Yes. What is the. Oh my god. Give me a second. Oh, Jason. Hell yeah, I'd be leaving that shit all. Max is fine, right? It has to be. Someone order a pizza? Pizza? Mom! Hey! <laughs> For now. I'm just glad you're safe. Further words died in his throat. Oh, should I hit? Oh no, she's to sick up that horrible parody of Nakoma. He forgot about his mother and Uncle Morgan. Oh my God. Not that. We've been calling you guys like crazy. I know. I'll take us for now. Came as soon as we heard. Her heart stopped for over a minute. She died. They say it's a miracle. There's like 20 minutes left. I'm like, I'm way too on edge. I was... Hey, uh, I'm, I'm sorry if that came out weird. What are you doing here? I didn't mean it like, what are you doing here? I just meant like, oh, what are you doing here? Like, wow, nice surprise. Great to see you. Uh, yeah, I didn't take it as anything negative. Okay, good, 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 good. No, no, I, I'm sorry. My brain's just been a little frazzled lately because of everything. I don't know what's wrong with me. Um, it's like sometimes my mouth is moving faster than my brain and it's like she can relate. My brain and I cannot seem to get it to stop no matter how hard I try. And where is Eddie now? I wish everyone had gotten to know him really know him they would have loved him even in the end he never stopped being Eddie despite everything <laughs> he isn't just innocent mr. Munson he's he's a hero <laughs> I didn't think I would feel this much about Eddie, to be honest. <laughs> this place is a total disaster. Yeah. Oh, I thought he was Leo already. Well, that's a bit of a problem. <laughs> I mean, I get we gotta hide Supergirl and all, but this isn't exactly like a fortress of solitude, man. It's more like a fortress of grodiness. Come on, guys, seriously. I just mean I'm glad you were with Mike and Will. And I'm... I'm glad you're here, too. Otherwise, who'd have been in charge? Hey. Yeah? Are we okay? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, totally. Come on, you two. have another chance let's hope not let's hope one is dead and rotting he's not nope. now that i'm here in hawkins i, I can feel him <sighs> and he's hurt 
Hop. <laughs> oh. oh shit. Oh shit. It's time to merge, I think. insane oh where to start okay we lost Eddie oh let me go we lost Eddie I mean it wasn't a complete surprise but like I still kind of like shit <laughs> And I didn't expect to get this emotional over Eddie because he was only in this for this season and I don't know. I didn't expect him to be the character he that he ended up being. At first I thought he was when I saw the trailer and like the first episode I thought he was like gonna be well the beginning of the first episode obviously in the end we know that he had anything to do with it. But I thought he was like on Vecna's side or something. I don't know. So uh, seeing how the character turned out for me was a surprise and I didn't expect to feel I actually could tear it up for him. And I'm not someone who cries often. So uh yeah. And then we didn't have time to breathe, and then we had Max almost dying. Now she's in a coma or unconscious. Elle can't find her, but L saved her. She brought her, her back. And of co obviously then we had, because she did die, we had the fourth uh, sacrifice, the gates opening, and um, that earthquake in Hawkins. And shit's about to hit the fan. And I'm expecting, I don't think we're going to get another time skip for uh, between for season four and five, because... This seems like a problem you deal with immediately. You don't wait a year until start the next plot so uh yeah steve nancy and uh robin steve especially is really good at burning <laughs> upside down monsters like at this point, this should be on his resume. Um, yeah. They didn't manage to kill him. He was uh, not really that bothered just by being on fire. So it's going to take quite a lot to kill him. 
I figure out and um Yeah. And I wasn't even I don't know, I think I expected him to die this season, but it makes sense that the last season will end with him because he's also the start of everything that's happened. And they confirmed it in this episode that it was him from the beginning. Um, the first, like, a shadow monster and stuff, and um, it was all him. I think it kind of was in my head that it was him. But th they confirmed it in this episode. So it makes sense to end it with him as well. Um... Mike and Elle finally, uh, or Mike finally told Elle what's been bothering him. They got it figured out. We have, um, Hop and Joyce. Jesus. Hop and Joyce, they're finally together. Murray kind of saving the day when he flambaged those Demogorgons, so. Awesome. Nancy and Jonathan. I can't believe they make it, they drag in this into uh, this love triangle into season five. I don't know. I still don't like it. And they're not talking really. They're just like Jonathan's still not telling her that he's not going to the same college as her. I forgot which one it was. She's uh, like kind of. Rediscovering maybe feelings for Steve, which I don't blame her. Steve is awesome. He's the best, but like, ah. yeah, that's all I can think of right now to say. I know there was just so much going on. My mind is like kind of all over the place and I don't really know what to talk about. So yeah, that's it. Stranger Things Season 4. Now we're gonna wait for Season 5. Hopefully that's gonna just take the regular year for new seasons to come out instead of another long wait like this. And then we're done. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for joining my journey of Stranger Things Season 4. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.